right. second nature to some, but one Northwest student is steering away from the average bike ride. BMX is bicycle motocross, and the BMX that I do is uh, freestyle BMX. I got started with BMX back in April. I had my old bike from when I was eight, and I decided to take that to the skate park. Ever since then, I've just been BMXing. Ben is one unique BMX rider because he he sets his mind to one trick every time until he gets it down 100%. When you're trying a new trick and you're scared to take your hands off the bars, like to do a tuck no hander, he looks like he would just, just go for it and try it. He's not afraid to try new things. With the grinds, I can do a feeble. I can do a double peg. I can do a smith. I can air up the three footer. 180 off of it. Biggest stair set I've done was a seven stair. Right now the most frustrating trick is the foot jam tail whip because I'm still trying to get my balance there. A BMX bike it's more for like stunts and stuff and like mountain bikes are for like riding getting to places. A BMX bike is a lot tougher than other bikes because you abuse them every day. Even with all the dedication these riders put into landing their tricks, controversy still exists regarding whether or not freestyle BMX is a sport. Many people wouldn't consider it a sport, but I think it should be because it's in the X Games, it's in the Olympics, I mean, you're on a bike. It's just something we like to do every weekend or every other day. The hardest thing is when you've been trying a trick for maybe two months and you're not getting anywhere at it. And you know, you just got to keep going on the trick until you finally get it smooth so they can do it every time with your eyes closed. To see more of these sick bikers, go to their YouTube channel, OPBMX. This is Grace Chapin with Andrew Swales, turning this story for Husky Headlines. It doesn't look like any of those athletes know where the spirit stick is. There is one biker who might know something. Good idea. Let's go ask Ben Paulson. High school students encounter twists, turns, and obstacles every day. But Northwest senior Ben Paulson takes his tricks to a different level. For me, it's just getting on my bike and, you know, just kind of doing my own thing, you know, trying new things, pushing myself, you know, even scaring myself. Like, uh, I think the best thing about BMX is you'll get such a rush when you land something, you know, so big and so gnarly that I just kind of chase that. He kind of taught me more than I taught him because since he was older, I always like looked up to him and tried to follow his footsteps and he's a good role model. Like the first year or so when I was riding, I definitely looked up to him because he was like the he was the only person I had to ride with at first as well. So it was just riding with him, I would just try to kind of copy whatever he did. Uh, and strengths include always having a good attitude, which is always fun to be around him. And he just he knows his limits, but sometimes he pushes himself. Paulson continues to improve his BMX tricks by taking inspiration from other sources. I take inspiration from other people. I see some people try different variations of what I'm doing and I kind of try that, you know, just to see how well I can do it. Like trying something new is always scary, like if, especially if it's like a feature you've never ridden before, something that's really tall, or like a big drop or something, it can be, it can be nerve wracking and it, it takes, sometimes it takes a lot of willpower and like confidence to actually go for it, but once you commit to it, you're typically really happy with the result unless you crash really bad. You know, good things always come at a price. You know, the many crashes I've taken, the many falls, and um, BMX has taught me that, you know, whatever I put my mind to is possible through BMX and through anything else that relates to my life. Using BMX as a relaxing pastime, Paulson will use his bike and BMX skills to incorporate this hobby into his future. This is Tanner Cowell and Jackson Latino for Husky Headlines.